This is my space mouse. I use it for cat design, but these devices could use a bit of an upgrade. And I lost a bit of the recording, but the guys of 3D Connection sent me a gift to help me with my project. There's a Space Mouse wireless kit, the Space Mouse Enterprise kit, which I've already opened and it looks like a spaceship control panel. And there's a big mouse with a middle button and a surface that is very slippery. And now they have a two-piece keyboard. Nice upgrade. This joystick helps me navigate 3D space with precision. Compared to the Pro version, the Enterprise comes with this display for the 12 custom keys. These are the shortcuts for Chrome because I've got it open, but once I switch to Fusion, we get the Fusion solid buttons. And as I switch to surface, the button changes. And again, for the mesh editing, these are some nice shortcuts to have at the fingertips. And when I want the numpad nearby, I can just shift it over. And now with the shape selected, I could extrude 10 millimeters. And here it is. And now I could perhaps want the fillet tool and maybe fillet five millimeters. And here we are. But what I like most is the fact that I can navigate in the 3D space very easily and see the details that I want to see. Here's another project I'm working on. And for me, it's very important to navigate the world easily. This way I can see if there's any error with the assembly. For example, here I can see this belt covers the screw hole. So I will have to fix that. Now you could do something similar with the keyboard shortcuts, but to me it just adds another level of joy on working on my favorite projects. I've been using the Pro version for a few years and it's been a joy. And now the guys at 3D Connection decided to help me with my project and offered to sponsor me with all these new toys. Let me do some cleanup. I can already tell that this will be a great desktop experience, but sometimes I travel and I still need to have my tools with me. And for that we've got this wireless kit, which is better for travel, slightly smaller mouse pad, same material, smaller mouse case, I suppose this is better for smaller hands or for travel, but it's still larger than my previous mouse. I'm used to the smaller ones, but I find this one quite comfortable. And last but not least, another travel case. Ta -da! We've got a small wireless space mouse. This is much more compact, but still quite heavy. And it only has two buttons on the sides compared to a few more buttons for this one. And here are all the options. I think they're all great depending on what you're looking for. This one is better for travel and obviously cheaper. This has all the buttons that I usually need like fit to screen, align to a certain plane, control, shift, alt and escape. And for this one we've got all the same buttons plus a few additional ones like spacebar and all these 12 custom keys. And if you don't like the options that you have for the keys, in here for the space mouse, you can configure all the buttons for each application independently. So these are the defaults for the Fusion Solid tools. And everything can be configured. And here I found a list of all the supported applications. And there are over 200. I was a bit worried about the keyboard because I like quiet keyboards, similar to the laptop keyboards and this one's are quite quiet, they are easy to press, but they feel really sturdy. I don't know how to explain this, but for my other keyboard, the keys are, have some sort of a play. Like this one got worse, it wasn't like this when I got it. Same for that one. 
but they kind of loosen up. So I'm quite happy how it feels and I also like this palm rest. And there's of course a hand rest for these two mice for working long hours. It's very good for the wrist so it doesn't bend like this for a long time. And again we've got these custom buttons. You can enable a toolbar to see what the buttons do. I can always show the on-screen display. And it's the same for the numpad. So now I've got them all down here and of course they change depending on which application is selected. So now I can extrude from this button or I can extrude from this button while using Fusion. The numpad is wireless, you charge it via the USB-C and you can use it on the right side or the left side. Maybe you're a lefty or maybe you want it next to the space mouse. For left-handed people there's also a left-handed mouse and both of these mice came with a dongle each but they can also connect to Bluetooth directly. And so for me, I think the best setup is this one for my desktop and this one for when I travel. They're really compact, I can use them with my laptop directly. And my Space Mouse Pro here will probably move to my workshop computer for occasional CAD modeling. So this will be my new toys for the next while. They've been sitting in a box for several months, but now I finally got to them and I'm so happy that I can use them. Thanks again 3D Connection, they did send me all these products up to here free of charge and they don't know that I'm filming this video but I've been using this brand for a long time and I wanted to share with you guys my enthusiasm about these new toys. But I know that these are not cheap products and not everyone can afford them. And to those, if you want to do CAD modeling or whatever else, keep in mind that you don't need any of these. You can get the cheapest keyboard and mouse and the cheapest computer that runs your software and still you can learn a lot and do a lot of amazing designs. These tools are not making me better, they're just making me faster at what I do. Alright, thanks for watching and stay awesome!